Hi everyone! So I'm coming on today with a, another project share. Oh, sorry, the camera's doing something weird there. So this is a... Why is it doing that? Okay, I don't think the camera likes something about this. Okay, I'll, if I hold it like this, maybe? Okay. Um, I wanted to make a junk journal that was kind of loosely inspired by peacocks and peacock feathers and just I love the colours of peacocks um, so that's what this is. I haven't decided what I'm going to use it for yet but um, it might be another quote journal um, because I just can't have enough quote journals so um, so this is the front. I'm not going to add any additional decoration I just like it as it is. This is the side where I've sewn in three signatures and the back is just the same and I haven't quite finished working on this yet. Um, I made it out of a cereal box. No, not a cereal box, a cardboard box. So I thought I would just show you before I covered it that that's what I made it out of. It's a nice thick piece of cardboard from a box. And I've just glued on some paper and then I'm going to cut some more paper sheets to go on the inside covers. So, um, yeah, I'll just flip through here and you can see all the different pages and things. So I've got this little one to start off with and here's my little peacock. I haven't glued him down yet. I um, thought he was absolutely beautiful. I cut him out of a piece of scrapbook paper. So he's kind of going to go there. So you'll see him when you open that. So let me get this page. Sorry, I am really awkward. <laughs> um, so this is some scrapbook paper. This is my favourite kind of colour. Um, <clears throat> Sorry, I also used up some things in here that I'm not as keen on, but I do like the colours of. So I'll probably cover most of this page, but I really like the kind of teal blue colour. And just folded it up to make a little pocket there. I'll be gluing this down and putting some journaling cards in here. This is just some painted paper that I did. And this is more scrapbook paper. And again, I don't like this paper, but I'll cover that with something. And this is from a colouring page. So I particularly liked this side, it really made me think of peacock feathers. And this is some scrapbooking paper that I painted some gold dots on. Not sure if you can really see the shimmer, but that's a metallic gold paint. And I painted this page with that. Just wanted some nice rich colours. There, I think you can see that there. Uh, some more purple scrapbook paper. This is a peacock envelope that I got from a writing set. And that's where I've sewn in my first signature. So this is just, um, this is paint as well. It's like a bronze, copper, metallic colour. And this is just the other side of those pages, obviously. So I'll skip past these. Okay. So that's the first signature. This is the second one. I haven't, um, I haven't bothered covering this yet. Um, I'm going to just put washi tape um, down in the middle. Um, so here's some more scrapbook paper. So whenever I'm working on this, is that just one sheet? No, it's two. So that was just a book page that I painted on. Um, whenever I'm working on this book, I will be painting in it as well. I'll be painting and doing collage and making some tags and journal cards and that kind of thing. Um, let me know if you would want to see that, kind of like a sort of craft with me kind of thing. Um, just more scrapbook paper. And most of these papers again were just chosen on um, kind of wanting to have those rich colours. Um, so I'll just go through this quickly because it's the same again. 
and then this is the last signature. So it kind of looks pink, but it's it's actually purple. It really is a, it really is a darker sort of purple when you see it in real life or off camera. You know what I mean. This is real life sort of, but you know what I mean. So and then this is the writing paper that goes with the peacock envelope. And see, this looks quite pink as well, but it's it's purple. It's purple and brown. And this is purpley pink, I suppose. Um, just the pages again. Yep, so that's it. Um, so I'm going to finish the finish the inside covers, put some paper on there, put some washi tape between the signatures and then I'll be using this for some mixed media and probably putting some quotes in or just writing some things that I want to remember in. So yeah, let me know if you want to see an update or if you want to see me work on it. And thanks for watching, take care, bye!